ओके गाइस टाइम टू वेक अप होप यू आर नॉट स्लीपिंग क्लोज टू अराउंड टेन टू इलेवन एम सी क्यूज आर फ्रॉम दिस स्लाइड ओके सो लेट्स बिगिन विथ डिओडिनम The cells of duodenum releases an enzyme called enterokinase, which converts trypsinogen into trypsin, right? And which in turn converts chymotrypsinogen into chymotrypsin, right? And from where does the trypsinogen come from? From the acini of the pancreas. You have another structure called islet of Langerhans. I have enlarged one of the islet of Langerhans. In the center, you have beta cell, which releases insulin, which everybody knows, plus amylin c peptide and proinsulin amylin is important right who sequenced the structure of insulin he was frederick sanger he got nobel prize for that what's the function of insulin of course it decreases the blood glucose it sends glucose to liver and skeletal muscle it breaks down glucose the process called glycolysis converts into glycogen called glycogenesis and also promotes lipid formation as well lipogenesis next is alpha cell which releases glucagon whose function is to increase blood glucose increase free fatty acids in blood and it's ketogenic mind well next is delta cells which release somatostatin which is universal inhibitor of everything it in, it uh, inhibits insulin glucagon growth hormone anything that's why somatostatin analogs are even used for decreasing secretion of any sort of tumor right next are the star cell which these are also called f cells or pp cell which releases pancreatic polypeptide mcqs which of the following is incorrectly paired f cell releases pancreatic polypeptide which the following types of cell releases amylin beta cell which is secreted along insulin <coughs> amylin nobel prize goes to sanger remember banting and maclard go, got nobel prize for discovery of insulin not sequencing of that structure this is a memory based question in fetus the insulin secretion begins at 3 month not done by insulin ketogenesis it is done by glucagon insulin increases the entry of glucose into skeletal muscle remember gi tract renal tubular cell and brain does not require insulin for glucose utilization extremely important gi tract renal tubular cell and brain does not require insulin insulin secretion is inhibited by look whenever you eat food it goes to your stomach and that food uh, increases the release of incretin group of hormone this incretin group of hormone increases the release of insulin to decrease the blood glucose level secretin and gastrin are a group of incretin uh, incretin like hormone along with glucagon like peptide 1 okay so these two increases the release of insulin growth hormone logically increases the release of insulin because you need glucose for growth so you're left with epinephrine and epinephrine decreases the insulin release by alpha 2 receptor okay all of the following enzyme are active except trypsin because it has precursor called trypsinogen which hormone has no role in growth look insulin and growth hormone both go hand in hand you need both glucose and growth hormone for growth testosterone of course for growth yes we are left with vasopressin anti diuretic hormone works with retention of water not with growth okay 